talk to myself because I've been driving for like four hours now and I'm bored. Um, so here's the stitch. I have been wanting to play my game, my silly little Red Dead Redemption game. You know, at night I dream about hunting deer and giving them to Pearson, but I have a job that I unfortunately have to perform nine to five on weekdays. So I, I get few chances to sit there for five hours at a time and play like I'd love to. Um, oh my God, like I'm looking at myself right now, I look clapped. Actually, you know what, let's not say that. That's bad for all the little girls out there watching. You know, all the little girls who watch live streams of Red Dead Redemption. Um, anyways, I've been trying to go live on Twitch. No reason, just because I like talking to myself and I think it's funny. I like to watch myself talk to myself later too. It's like I, I document. Basically. You know what? I guess it's kind of like me journaling, but I'm also like playing games. Well, now this is like me journaling, but I'm also driving. Anyways, this is my new car. Check it out. What? What? Um, headed on the way to the bay for Thanksgiving. So I'm gonna be working from home for like three days and then Thanksgiving because I don't get Thanksgiving break off. And this is the first time that I don't have like school. <laughs> so I can't just go home and not, uh, excuse me. I can't go home and like not do work. What? Well, you know what I'm saying? Like usually when I'm on break at school, it's like in between semesters or something. So I don't have homework and I don't have class and <laughs> And I'm like um, in between and I don't have anything to worry about. But now it's like, I gotta, I'm gonna drive over there and nobody fucking cares. I just gotta hop back on there and keep doing my little thing. Keep crunching numbers. But it's fine. I love my job. It's just like, I would like to do my job while I'm at my job and have it not interfere with the rest of my life. I saw this tweet once that was like something about nine to fives being like horrible and like it's forcing us to squeeze our life in between the cracks of like between the nine to five and at first i was like that's kind of valid like life is supposed to be everything except work right so all like my life is just my five to nine in, in the morning whatever but all i do is i really i just sleep and i do my laundry and i cook i almost said I cook my dishes i cook dinner and i wash my dishes but you know what i'm kind of okay with like the majority of my life being my job because I chose my job because I like my job. So I was just thinking about all the people out there who fucking hate going to their jobs and they go there because they have to. That's fucked up. I, don't, I forgot what I was talking about. But basically, I want to play my games but I can't and I feel bad about the lack of consistency and I wanted to just make it clear that I wasn't dropping the channel. Tina, I'm not dropping my channel, guys. I'm going on a hiatus. Um, I don't know. I don't know what I fucking wanted to say. I just wanted to be like, hey, what's up? Checking in. How you guys doing? Let me know. All my usual chatters out there. Miss you guys. Think about you every day. Come home. Literally every day, actually. I come home from work and I'm like, fuck. Should I stream? And then I'm like, no, I gotta do my laundry. Like, I literally can't even close my washer anymore because it's just full of fucking pants. Um, but I think about it. I consider it, but I, I'm choosing the responsible life because I saw this other tweet. I'm on Twitter a lot. So I saw this other tweet that was like, if you think about it, like we're just apes in our enclosures. You know what I'm saying? Like, of course your mind's gonna get screwy when your apartment is dirty and you haven't washed your dishes. It's like the tiger gets agitated when its enclosure is cluttered. And I was like, shit, dude, they're right. Like I kind of like am playing Tamagotchi with myself. I have to like, clean my toilet and shit like that and I can't just ignore it because that's that's not good I gotta like take care of myself and not even like a yes take care of yourself love yourself type way which I do believe but it can get corny sometimes but I mean like I gotta take care of myself in like in the meaning that like I'm like a hamster like I gotta like clean up my droppings and shit like that dude speaking of droppings I want a cat so bad. I've been thinking of getting a cat. I'm like talking to my coworker who fosters cats and she was like, oh yeah, like I think this cat would be a good fit for you because I was asking specifically for black cats that are boys and that are like over a year old 
And this is because my favorite Ghibli movie, or Ghibli, however you want to say it, is um, Kiki's Delivery Service. And in Kiki's Delivery Service, one of the main characters is a little cat, a little boy cat, full black cat, because the movie's about a witch, and his name is Gigi, like J-I-J-I, -I, not like G-I-G-I, -I, like a girl name, okay? And so I want my own cat, and I'm going to name it Gigi. And it has to be a year old because, again, like I've been half complaining, half just sort of neutrally talking about, I have a job, so I have to go to my job every day. I want to go to my job, I can't leave a cute little kitty, I can't leave a tiny little kitty baby kitty in my apartment because it's like, it's that's its enclosure, you know what I'm saying? I can't just leave it there, it's not going to be entertained. His mind isn't going to develop. He's just going to be like, dicking around, scratching my furniture, not talking to anyone. But the adult cats, as I've researched, but I'm probably, I don't know, I'm definitely not an expert in this, but research means I fucking googled it, so, um, I've heard that from Google, adult cats can sit by themselves for a little bit and they'll be fine. Like I can go to work and come back and he's just chilling. But I also am thinking like, I'm gonna put some sort of like anti-cat scratching screen protector on my iPad and I'm gonna give it to my, to Gigi. This, this thing about a cat that like is not confirmed yet to Gigi, I've already named it. And then Gigi is gonna fucking play Fruit Ninjas for me, and I'm gonna watch him. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put all sorts of sh I'm gonna make Gigi addicted to the internet. I know cats are smart, I'm gonna put that bitch on Among Us, and we're, <laughs> we're gonna be like MagCon on my Twitch channel, except it's gonna be me playing Red Dead and then Gigi playing Among Us. And I say Among Us because lately I've been watching this guy called Griffmas, and he's just, like his whole thing is he yells at kids on Among Us VR because like you're supposed to be 13 or older to play but there are like some babies on there like four or five years old and I have a squeaky little voices and I have I love kids so it's so cute just watching them like play and like befriend each other um but yeah anyways I am going to drive through a scary little part it's raining right now not very hard but um I should probably pay attention I have one hand on the wheel right now which I actually drive like this all the time and shit so I'm fine but like I'm gonna put two hands on the wheel now all right ta ta later good chat good shit good seeing you guys take care xoxo ttyl wait what's it Ex wait wait the thing that Bella Thorne says beep beep be my bff the ttyl xox okay bye